ninth edition of the Summit of the Americas opened this Monday in the U.S. city of Los Angeles. According to some political analysts, this summit reflects the hegemonic ideology of the United States. The principle of America first is no longer in line with the needs of Latin American countries for independence and regional integration. On the same day, Mexican President Andrés Manuel López Obrador reaffirmed that he would not attend the meeting. He insisted that there cannot be a summit of the Americas if all the countries of the American continent do not participate, and it's time to change the dominant political practice. Later this day, Venezuelan President Nicolas Maduro thanked his Mexican counterpart for his decisive and firm decision and solidarity with the nations excluded from the summit. In a statement published on Monday, Cuba called the decision of the United States discriminatory and unacceptable, saying the U.S. government has engaged in intensive, high-level efforts with governments of the region, seeking to reverse the intention of many of not attending the meeting unless all countries are invited. En una cumbre de un par de días no se solucionan los problemas históricos de la región y de la región frente a Estados Unidos. El mundo ha cambiado y tenemos que acostumbrarnos a eso. Y pues Estados Unidos va a tener que entender que descuidó América Latina y no somos el patrio trasero, sino Estados eh, América Latina se está dando a respetar. Hoy vivimos en un mundo distinto al de los años 40 y 50. Hay cambios sustanciales en el mundo, hay nuevas instituciones, nuevas reglas. Hoy en día, Estados Unidos efectivamente ha perdido liderazgo internacional y eso es evidente.